Nostalgic fans, this is Alex with Nostalgic to the Max with another video. Today I am going to be showing you my boyfriend's Nickelodeon collection. He's behind the camera right now, Justin at Justin Talks Puppets. Hello. So because this collection is really big, we're just gonna do Spongebob today because he could be his own video. Hey everybody, I'm Justin, Alex's boyfriend. Everything Spongebob that I've collected from childhood. Sorry Alex, where would you like to start? Lord, I don't know. This is the Operation game, Spongebob Operation. The next thing that's next to that is the Funko Pop. This is the Spongebob Sweet Sweet Victory Spongebob Squarepants. This is classic for any Spongebob fan, a classic episode. Matches your shirt. Matches my shirt. A. Next pop that we got here is the F is for friends who do stuff together, you with you and me. The fun Spongebob <laughs> pop here. Mm -hmm. Plankton right there. Oh my gosh, I didn't notice these there. Little, his tiny little body on the U. Here's some of the other pops you can get in the back. These are from my childhood. These are actually have been in my personal collection for a while. These are like SpongeBob candy dispensers. Just for Christmas when I was little. To open his head right here, there would be SpongeBob. They look like Flintstone vitamins, but they're actually a SpongeBob Pez, like but shaped like him that you could eat. This is another SpongeBob candy dispenser. Once again from my childhood. This one's from 2004. And then this, of course, is I'm a big Pez collector. <laughs> So, uh, this is a Spongebob in his underwear, looking kind of crazy. <laughs> this is another punch from my childhood. It's by the company Tai, who they make, you know, the Tai Bears and stuff like that. So here we go with the Spongebob book collection. So this is the Spongebob Saves the Day. It's three books in one. Pretty cool. Has a bunch of different stories in here and stuff like that. Really cool artwork. Another Spongebob book. The trophy. I want an award. <laughs> Merry Krusty Christmas. Aww. All these books are pretty much from 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. It's awesome because that's our childhood. Yep. This is really cool. It's a Spongebob book where you can learn how to animate them and stuff like that. How to do a thing called squash and stretch. And cool fun fact, I took animation in high school. So you have to draw. We have a jumbo word search puzzle that we found at Dollar Tree. Then we have a jumbo, everything's jumbo, jumbo coloring and activity book. Look how cute. Yeah, Spongebob Squarepants Mistaken Identity. These are actually pretty cool. I love this the space. Is a comic book version of the Spongebob episodes. It's like comic book style. So here's the back explains to you about the comic. This we found at Dollar Tree. It's another coloring and activity book. It comes with stickers. Stickers. Back, show you what's in the back. This is a Spongebob, this is your paint with water type of book. So inside the book, they show you kind of how to paint the picture. No so guys, I'm not playing tricks on you. That's to help you know how to color. This is a SpongeBob spot the difference. If you go through the book, there's like different pages and you try to spot the difference. <laughs> Kids picture book, so there's that. This one's from... This might be 2010s. 2008, very close. Oh, okay. It is from a Halloween episode. I love that episode. <laughs> <laughs> and this is also another Spongebob episode. The amazing Spongebob Beanie? Yep, he's a <laughs> magician. I remember watching this one, and this was the Suds uh, episode. I love this episode. I don't like Alex's face when she said, can I take care of it? This looks probably 2002-ish, just based on the Nick logo. So pretty cool. <laughs> I do remember going to the book fairs and seeing a lot of these books in those book fairs. I know, right? Class confusion. There's all the Spongebob books. Comment below if you have a collection of Nickelodeon books or Spongebob. Okay everybody, so now we're on to DVDs and Spongebob movies. This is the first complete season. It was a birthday gift from the beautiful girl behind the camera. <laughs> the first season of Spongebob season two. E. This is the third complete season. Again, was another birthday gift from the beautiful girl behind the camera. <laughs> the uh, chocolate one's on that one. Chocolate. Mm -hmm. My parents went to a Savers strip store, end up finding season seven of SpongeBob at the store. Of course, we have the first original SpongeBob movie here that uh, I feel like us we grew up with. On this again at a thrift store. CD's not as coolly designed. Artwork on the box is cool. The casing. This is another one we found at Savers. It's a SpongeBob movie. Sponge out of water. So these were all the Spongebob DVDs. Now we're on to these awesome bad boys. If you grew up from our childhood, you know what these things are. Plug and play TV games. This comes with, I believe, four to five games. My favorite one was uh, go around and he has to like catch all the bubbles or pop the bubble or throw the bubble up in the air and then catch it. Now this is also a later one that was made. Kids plug and play game. There's games on here. Uh, you got to make a Krabby Patty. You got to dress Spongebob, which is cool. Pretty, pretty cool. Move on to these stickers right here. We actually found these recently at a Dollar Tree. I thought these were pretty cool. Oh no, we forgot a book. So here's another book. Found this at a Saver Thrift Store. These are Spongebob themed erasers and they're still in the package. 
these are other some other stickers I actually have when I was a kid. So I don't know if anybody remembers this, but if you used to go into maybe a 99 cent store, Dollar Tree, those are still around. But when we were kids, they used to have uh, like a toy stand, coin machine thing. Uh, we got SpongeBob monies. <laughs> Here's another one, again from the Money Sticker Series. All right, this is a SpongeBob birthday card. <laughs> my beautiful girlfriend gave me this for my birthday. This is pretty cool. Found this at Target. Lights, camera, action, shout. Time to get the sillies out. We have Maze Mania. It's a maze book. You try to solve a whole bunch of mazes and stuff. There's another SpongeBob sticker. It's the You Ooh. Like Patty Patty, Don't You Scooter. That's my favorite episode. Uh, found this at Target. It's a mini figure set by Kid Robot. Imagination. SpongeBob underpants. This is by uh, Hollywood Rides. They just had a series come out where they had a bunch of movie. Hollywood Rides, that's, that's, what, that's what it's called that. So this is the SpongeBob themed one. They actually have a bigger version of this. So this is a smaller version. And the whole truck is painted SpongeBob with his face. SpongeBob Glove World playset. These might've been sold separately, which I think they were. <laughs> There's a Glove World SpongeBob. These are Imaginex, uh, Krusty Krab, and Chum Bucket, Oops. and then Jellyfish Felix. <laughs> uh, Galley Grub. And then here are some of the figures that I've collected. Got Happy SpongeBob. <laughs> Brown, brown. We got fried cooked SpongeBob. Mm -hmm. Getting ready to grow up some Krabby Patties. We got, I don't know if this is Super Patrick or Super Patrick from the Sponge Out of Water movie. Wrestler Patrick. We got regular Patrick here. <laughs> I'm a giraffe. And we got uh, jellyfish. The jellyfish fields. Jellyfish fields. Jellyfishing SpongeBob. I think he came with a jellyfish in that. Gotta find that. Mr. Crab's monies. Mr. Crab's his monies. That's why he's smiling. He literally is cool. He's going have And here's Sleepy SpongeBob. All right, fun fact, we actually found these at Dee Dee's Discount. So the only place that we saw it was Dee Dee's Discount, so SpongeBob's happy face on there. <laughs> Again, found these at Dee Dee's Discount. SpongeBob, flip flop sandals, whatever you want to call them. All right, Alex, so what do you think? Well, it's really big on me. My hands are like... You look adorable, here. baby. <laughs> oh, it's like a dress on me, isn't it? You look adorable, you like a little Eskimo. <laughs> really big. You feel like a member only, as it says on your hood? I guess so. I wouldn't go out in the snow with it because it is not going to keep you warm. It's going to go right through this. Alright, so that is it for this video. Like and subscribe and ring that bell if you want to see more nostalgic stuff or unboxings. Yeah, um, we'll see you guys next time and I hope you enjoyed this video. Bye.